Hey, Dumb and Bums family. I'm Claire Falconer, personal trainer, yoga teacher, and health and nutritionist coach. So I'm going to be bringing you today a booty workout. So a little bit of a booty burn. It's just going to be basically focused on the booty. So I hope you enjoy. Get ready to get the burn on and I'll see you on the mat. Up as always, we are going to start with a warm up. Okay, so you're gonna come down. Oh, there's prickles everywhere. Um, you're gonna come down onto your mat. You're gonna lay down onto your back and we're just gonna help by warming up those glutes. So we're just going to do a glute raise, making sure that your core's engaged, facing down. And we're just going to walk out and in. Out and in. Good. So we're just going for 10 here, making sure that you're not pushing up with the back, using those glute muscles and your hamstrings to keep your body up. We'll do one more and rest, okay? We're gonna come into a glute activation exercise. So again, you're going to activate your core. You're going to lift those legs nice and wide, then close them again, keeping your body nice and still, keeping your hips in one place. And you're just gonna open and close using those glute muscles. Four, we're just going to turn. Five, six, seven, eight, and two more. One, good, last one, and two. Perfect, rest, placing your feet back down onto the floor. You're just gonna twist those hips from side to side just in case we can have a little bit of tension into the spine. We're going to do both of those exercises one more time, okay? So again, you're going to engage that core, making sure that you're nice and strong throughout the core. Everything is turned on. Knees hip distance apart, and you're just going to walk those feet out and in for 10, 3, 4, 5, Seven, eight, two more, one, last one, and two. Beautiful, coming down onto the mat. Now we're gonna readjust, engaging that core, making sure that everything's nice and turned on, lifting up the hips, knees hip distance apart, and you're going to open and close. One, two, engaging those glutes, three, you should feel them firing now. Four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. One, good, last one, and two. Beautiful. Again, just twist those hips from side to side. Just a couple of times. Beautiful. Okay, we're going to come up onto your mat. We're just going to do a couple of reverse lunges. So just different variations just to get those glutes firing once again and then we'll get into the full workout okay so all you're going to do is you're going to do a step back lunge forward okay so right side we're going to 10 on each leg two three four making sure as always five six seven that your knee is in line with your middle two toes I do not want to see any knees knocking in. Two more. Last one. And swap your legs. Two more. One. Last one. Okay, now that your glutes are nice and engaged, nice and warm, we're going to get into the workout. Um, so it's going to be, again, all booty related, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to start off with a nice deep squat. It's going to be squat three quarters. So what this does is it really helps turn on your glutes, okay? So I'll demonstrate and then we'll get into it. So we're going to go all the way down, lifting up to halfway. Not like that. Okay, so what we're going to do so we're going to do all the way down, lifting up halfway, all the way down, back up, okay? That's being one. Cool? Two. Beautiful. 
for you. I want you to really control the movement here. Do not be jumping in and out of the pose, okay? So it's here, lifting up, controlled, down, controlled, up fully, thrust that glute. Okay, keep them going. Two, we're just going to 10. Should be about on five. Good. Remember to control that movement. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. One. Good. Last one. You will also feel this, obviously, in the quads. Okay. Now we're going to go into my favorite of all glute exercises, which is curtsy lunges. So what we're going to do is get into position, Woo, looking straight forward, and you're going to just go down into the curtsy, lifting up, and then down. So we're just going to do static curtsies, okay? Three, four, five. Looking forward, six, keeping the front foot looking forward. Seven, eight, nine, last one and 10, perfect, swapping your legs. So right foot facing forward, left foot coming over the body, engaging that right glute, and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, one, good, last one, and two, perfect. Okay, you're going to come down onto the floor now. So what we're going to do is you're going to bring your body up to a plank. So you're on all fours, tabletop position, and your leg is going to come out straight, and then you're going down with the glute, okay? Touching the floor, back up. Two, three. Try to keep your hips nice and still. Four, five, and your core nice and Eight, two more, one, last one, and two. Beautiful, swap the legs. Okay, so again, one side will always be harder than the other. Stretching your leg out, opposite leg, coming to tabletop, turning on that core, lifting from the glute, and up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, two more, one, last one, and two. Beautiful. Okay, I've got my puff on. Whew. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna repeat all those over again. Okay, we are gonna go straight into round two now. So again, we're going to bring your feet just slightly out from hip distance apart. You're gonna go down into the squat, lifting up half, quarter way, down full, up full. Okay, that's one. Again, making sure that you have control in this pose. So I don't want to see you just pulsing or jumping in and out of it. Your legs should control the movement. Three, thrusting at the top. Four, good. Five. To ten. Six. Seven. Eight, two more. One, good, last one. And two, perfect. Okay, again, my fave, curtsy lunges. So you're gonna bring your left foot in front, making sure that it's facing forward, bringing your right leg around your body, chest nice and tall, try to keep those hips facing somewhat forward, and down, two, just to 10, three, Good. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. One. Last one. Beautiful. And swap. Right leg in front, making sure the toes are facing forward, bringing that left leg behind you. And we're going down. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Seven, 
eight, two more. One, good, last one. Two, perfect. Coming down onto the floor. Coming into tabletop, lifting up your hips, engaging your core. Dropping your head so that your spine's nice and one line, okay? Squeezing those glutes, lifting your right leg out front and up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. One last one and swap. Beautiful. Give yourself a little bit of a rest, especially those arms. Holding up your full body can be somewhat challenging. So bringing your right foot fixed onto the ground. Can't bring your body up. Left leg nice and straight and up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. One and two. Beautiful. Good work, guys. That's round two. Going into round three now. Okay, this is round three of exercises. This is going to be a final round and we're going to be laying on the floor. So it's going to be nice and gentle, okay? So you're going to lay down onto the floor, bringing your hips um, hip distance apart, just so you can touch the heels of your feet, hips facing forward, knees facing up, not knees out like this, okay? And what we're going to do is we're going to go into some glute raises, okay? So in, first of all, remembering, engage that core, tuck it under, and then we're going to lift up and down. Just doubles to start with. Two, three. We're going for ten, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Remembering and rest it. Squeeze from the glutes always. Don't want to see any backs pushing up too much. Okay, now you're going to lift your right leg up into the sky, placing your hands onto the floor, and lifting up that glutes. Two, three, four, five. Keeping that core engaged. Six, seven, eight. Two more. One and two. Good. Other side. Left leg nice and straight. Hands fixed onto the floor. Engaging that core. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. One and two. Good. And rest. We're going to repeat that one more time. And then that is it for us today. Okay. You're going to lay down onto your back again for your last and final round for today. Making sure that your feet are hip distance apart. Knees facing forward, core turned on, placing those hands down into the floor, lifting up for 10, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, squeeze that glue, 8, 9, last one, and 10, beautiful. We're giving yourself a slight rest and then we're going to lift up your right leg up into the sky, left leg coming up. Squeezing that glute, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, one, last one, and rest. Beautiful. Okay, last leg. Lifting that left, left leg into the sky, turning that core on, placing the hands down into the floor, three, four, five, Seven, eight, two more, one and two. Good work. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was relatively easy, but your booty will be burning. Um, have a great workout again. If you felt that was too easy, you can always do it all over again. Um, enjoy a nice relaxing stretch after this and have a wonderful day. Bye guys.